Let's get rich, what? The GK Vines and Sugar Dimes can't quit, what? Now pop the caucus, lean the Vega and get lit, what? 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 Introducing Phantom Up. What's up, everybody? Gorilla Ferella, and I'm coming to something, coming to you with something a little bit different this time. This is a team deathmatch on Molten. What? Team yep. Hey, yeah. Hey, this is Transformers hey, War of Cybertron. And this game is the shit. It is tight. I'm not gonna lie. Like it seems like I'm. I don't know, I'm the kind of person that doesn't like Halo like the reason for this fact that it's like aliens and shit and I think that's hella stupid and like I don't know that's like but this game I thought I wouldn't like it because it's Transformers and doesn't that sound hella stupid like especially if you're like a Call of Duty player like you're I don't know you're primarily a Call of Duty player but uh, this game it really it's it's sick like I have so much fun playing this game because it's made by Activision and uh, Activision now they like join with Bungie or whatever, so now they kind of have like a grip on the Halo thing. So this game kind of like combines elements from like Halo, Call of Duty, and and yeah, like Halo and Call of Duty, and it's third person, so it's kind of like Gears of War. But um, but it's very similar to Call of Duty, like the button layout. Like I my tran my skills transferred over very quickly because I picked up on like the controls very fast, like. How I was driving my car and everything. That's just the sprint button from COD. And then, or like that, the uh, left analog stick. And then zooming in is the left trigger. Shooting is right trigger. Reload is X. Jumping is A. So, um, so yeah, and then they have like perks. And then you can like customize your class loadout thing. There's, a, there's like two specific classes, which are um, the scout and the soldier. That's all that's available in the demo. There's also a scientist and fuck and leader, scientist and leader. I don't know what they have special about them, but uh, for the soldier, you can have like the. I'm just I I don't really know like what the name of all this shit is, so I'm just gonna like refer to it as Call of Duty stuff. So like you can have like this LMG kind of gun or like a heavy assault rifle, which I'm using right here. This is it, <clears throat> and then also. You can have like an uh, a normal assault rifle, or I guess like a lighter assault rifle, like SMG style kinda. And um, they have uh, like a a shotgun and what else they got? They got uh, that's basically like that's all the stuff I know for this for the uh, soldier. The best gun I like is what the one I'm using right now. I can't remember what it's called, but it's um it's got like the most damage, but it has like a slower rate of fire. And it has a uh, slightly better range, but I like that. And oh yeah, and also right there, like, see how I was in my like little tank mode thing? You can um, I guess that's like a third weapon. I guess it's like a cannon, and it's, if you shoot them, it's only direct impact. If you shoot them directly with it, it's a it's a one hit kill. So it's a really good thing to use. But um, but they're harder. They're harder to they're harder to hit people with because it is super slow rate of fire. But it's a uh, but it's cool, like when you come up on a group of people, you're trying to take a couple out before you get into the battle with them. You like shoot, and then you start fighting. But this game, it's it's hella fun because in Call of Duty, it's more about like map map knowledge and movement and everything, and being in the right place at the right time. This game's more like you see someone, and you two, you fucking battle, you battle that shit out. Like right here, see, we're shooting each other. And I pull out the hammer and I molly whopped his ass. But it's uh, it's it's hella cool. I recommend da definitely downloading this demo. I I don't think PS3 has the demo, but Xbox, download this demo. Give it a try. Don't talk shit about this game until you try it because I would have totally expected this game to suck. But um, there's some I saw some videos on YouTube about it, and they they were talking about how awesome it is, and so I tried it out. And they were right. This game is so much fun. Like the other day, I was playing Call of Duty, and I was just getting frustrated. I couldn't, cause um, on my M16 on Rundown video, and then my Carnival, you guys have been like offering me or suggesting classes for me to use, and I've actually been doing them. I've gone about, I've probably got about six suggestions, I'd say, or six or seven. And I've gotten about three of them done so far, 
and some of the ones you guys give me are kind of ridiculous they're really hard to do but i'm gonna keep trying and if i just i'm trying not to give up on them even though they do suck really really bad <coughs> but um but you know i really want to try to get these gameplays because uh you guys asked for them and you want to see them so so i was playing that and i was just getting super frustrated the game was pissing me off a lot uh, Modern Warfare 2 was pissing me off a lot. So yeah. So then I just hopped on this game, played about three games, and I had a smile on my face the whole time. It's just, it's just, oh, it's just so much fun, and it's exciting. And when you get in a battle with someone, you're just like, you have more time to think about what you're gonna plan out, what you're gonna do, like throw a little stun grenade. They have like stun grenades in this game. They're called um, uh, EMP or I think they're EMP something. EMP nades. I don't know. But it's just like stun grenades. It disorientates you for just like a couple seconds, and uh, those are really effective when you see like a group of people coming at you. And you need to take one out at a time, because in this game it's like really hard to group kill a group of people. Like right here, see how long it's taking me to kill just one guy. Like I'm shooting the hell out of him, but it, it takes long. It takes longer in this game to kill uh, to kill people. So when you run up on a group of people, then um, and that guy whooped me. I'm hella mad. But yeah. Uh, when you roll up on a group of people, like three people, the chance of you getting all of them is, it's highly unlikely because it's a lot amount of, you can take a lot of hits in this game and still be alive. And then there's also, there's some blue, like bluish, whitish boxes you'll see around the map. And instead of having health regeneration over like time, this game has it so where, um, you pick those up and it, rege it regenerates your health fully. Like in the top left hand corner you'll see I have like the six blue bars of health and um, and those go down as I'm fighting someone as I get hit <clears throat> and um, and if I pick up one of the blue boxes then I will I'll regenerate all my health. So you can't be just running around in this game just running and gunning because eventually by all these people and then you'll get killed. I'm sorry if I cut out there for a second. My bad. I accidentally hit the mute button. But um, yeah, this game is awesome. I went 10 and 6. There's only 40 kills in team deathmatch, so that's that's a decent amount. That's like a fourth of the kills. But yeah, get this game. It's tight. Peace.